What is up, everybody? It's the Game Dex here. We are back with another episode of our BDSP playthrough. In the last episode, we kind of stopped mid route. Uh, the episode was going on a bit too long, and there was still, in my opinion, a bit to this route. I, I, I could be completely wrong, but I still feel like there's. There's still like two or three trainers, and that would have probably just take. Ooh, ooh, oh, 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 shadow ball. I probably would have taken us um very deep. Brian, no shadow ball. Roselia and Skarupi. Ro Skarupi, no, but Roselia, maybe, maybe. Now I I know 40 minutes isn't too terribly long, but I also know. That the shorter videos are more, yeah, at least three battles, are more on the receiving end. It's easier to watch in one sitting than 40 minutes, which I watch YouTube all day, so it's, I, I don't do, I, I don't know. I can't completely see it because I'm perfectly fine watching a 40 minute episode. It's just the general, people have not the attention span. Black Belt Adam. So, that's why I've been trying to keep the series 25 to 30, because it's only daily episodes now, and 20 to 30 back when we were doing... Yo, he's level 29. Back when we had the double episodes. But I think... I think we're in a... Well, it's a decent... I think it's a decent length. And the perfect thing with this is... It's going to basically combine the rest of this route with Celestia Town. So it, it kind of just works out perfectly and we'll we'll make it work. That's that's what we do. Play the game, make it work, continue through, get the next gym badge, keep playing, done. Um, it is crazy to me. What is it? We're how how slow? How slow the game plays when you record it. Um now, it's going to be even, like, this is going to feel even slower for you guys. Um, but I, I'm so used to already having the game completed and already racking up, like, 70 plus hours in this game by this point. And I'm only at 20. I, I guess, I, okay, there's a ninja, so four battles. I guess, A, you become older, you have less time for the game. But even still... I, I would have at least had this game beaten. Probably wouldn't have done as much underground as I have. But in the sense of actual gameplay, this game would be done. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Krogunk's kind of, kind of bit of a threat. I mean, not fully. And Krogunk's not going to have a lot of moves. Like, it might have, what, Brick Break to hurt us? But it's too slow at this point. Since it didn't do it already. Goodbye, Krogunk. You're done. You're done for. Yo, levels 36. Everything. Everything except for our boy Skarupi is at the ace of the next gym leader. Which actually... I mean, it doesn't seem too far off. Like, cause what? The only thing, after we finish the Celestia Town, we don't go to the snow area yet. That's, that's saved till after the 6th gym. So other than a couple battles, we might not be too far off. I mean, now, this completely changes if I decide to go back to Pastoria and go through those routes. But if we don't do that, I, I do want to battle all the gym trainers because Drifloon is there. And the only way to get Drifloon is on Friday. And I mean, it could be likely. It could be next Friday when I... It could be a Friday after I beat the game, but I just want to... I, I, I want to be sure to be able to get to the post game without having to worry too much. And I think Drifloon 
is really only the bad one. Like, the other ones you can fight trainers, like, on routes and such, or encounter Pokemon. But Drifloon is really that one where if you don't fight it in the gym, you have to. You have to. Uh, get the encounter. And that's only a once a week thing in the morning. Although I've seen people do it at night, so maybe nighttime is fine. But I, maybe they changed it. This battle is done. Oh, there's an item right there, and I don't have waterfall. Oh, it's so, so painful. Yo, I'm going to actually use Magnezone. We've used Skaroopy so much, it's always a cha nice change of pace. Being able to use Magnezone and Mamoswine, occasionally Gastrodon. Uh, Roselli and Infernape are way too strong. They just sit there, but... Weasel! Perfect. <laughs> Perfect that we swapped into our Magnezone. I knew. I knew up here that he was going to use a Weasel. Thunderbolt. As long as you don't have a ground type, I could even Bolt Switch. Even though with how weak your levels are, even like a neutral hitting one will still do quite a bit of damage. And Roselia... It's level 38. Machoke. Yeah, this... This'll knock him out. I'm certain it will. Bop. Just... Just the levels. The levels difference. Ten levels. Girafferig. Interesting Pokemon, but still won't change a fact. Thunderbolt, you're done. No, I, I, I do wish the level will... I, I do wish they changed the level scaling, and... That's my biggest complaint about the game, is the levels. I mean, it doesn't make the game unfun. I speak about it a lot, but it doesn't make the game unfun. It just... It has no sense of difficulty, especially if you really know how to play the game. Now, if you're new to the game... I mean, even people that are old to the game, they might skip some trainers, so maybe it's not the same for them. But if you're new to the game, I, I think it does make the game more pleasant for that person. It's just I've been playing Pokemon since Fire Red and Leaf Green, before Diamond and Pearl were even a thing. So now that the remakes are out, I, I can handle it. Um, I do... I think it does also balance out without the fact of having to grind. Not having to sit in the grass and train up a team is nice. So we take the goods and the bads. And we go. We work with it. We made it to Celestic Town. I feel like I've called it Celestia and Celestic Town. But it's Celestic Town. And we're here. We can arrive at the PC. Talk to people. It's been around since Sinnoh was made. Does that mean Celestic Town is in Legends? Or does that mean since Sinnoh isn't a thing yet because it's the Hisui region? That it's not a thing yet. A great ball. Thank you. Um, I probably won't use the great ball as much as any other Pokeballs. Oh, is this... If I were only younger... Okay, uh, there's some guy planning on blowing up the place with a bomb. Uh, YouTube, please do not <laughs> demonetize me. The game literally writes that down. I must bear down and train, and for that time, time is unimportant. Therefore, I have no need for a watch. Take this from me. Okay. Okay. So we got this watch, typically. And now... Where are you? We have this watch. Okay, two watches. Depends on which one you like. I, I mean, if you can read it, that watch isn't bad, but... The fact that, like... 
they basically tell you the time. There's there's no need for that clock in this game. But you know, you know, it's fine. Yo, they actually have regular items here. Whoa, that's wild. I'm pretty sure this place used to only sell like herbs. No. Yo, yo, yo. Oh, this place is this shop. This shop is the clutch stop. Quick balls are nice. Dust balls are amazing. Timer balls are pretty good too. I'll take 30 of each. Um, we're running low on money again. Sell. Do I have anything worth selling? Oh, yo. Oh, that's great. Wait, what about here? Do I? No, that's poke balls. Berries. No thanks. Don't sell those. Treasures. Yeah, I really don't have... I don't have much to sell. Oh, we, we do need to battle people. We need our money back. Um, that, That's kind of wild. I don't feel like that used to be there in the originals. I don't think you could just buy anything. Yo, this... She said sister. Is this Cynthia's sister? Just a random NPC? Got it. It's an old book. You begin to read it. When that Pokemon was born, intelligence bloomed among us, enriching our lives. When that Pokemon was born, emotions bloomed among us, giving us joy and sorrow. When that Pokemon was born, willpower bloomed among us, spurring us into action. Is this talking about the three Lake Guardians? Where are you from? Hmm, Twinleaf Town, you say? Isn't that close to Lake Variety? That lake is said to be home to Mespirit, the being of emotion. It must be looking over you. Got it. Got it. I knew it. I knew it. Um, so that first house, the one with the mart, must have been the old herbal shop. And I don't know why they didn't keep it there. If I climb to the top of Mount Cornet, will I be able to see all of Sinnoh? Um, I, I mean, I will, I'm great. I'll gratefully take all those balls. But herbs, herbs, let us buy herbs. Um, is that it for over here? Oh, this is just a normal trainer. This isn't even Cyrus. This is just a normal person being like, yeah, I'm gonna do it. Don't make me. I'm a little psycho. I, I just, I was hoping there was an item. No. Okay. Okay, my dude. This town is insignificant. There's nothing of value here. It doesn't need to exist, so I will blow it up with a galactic bomb. If you try to mess with me, I'll shut you down with a Pokemon battle. So what's it gonna be? Are you? I'm, of course I'm gonna mess with you. Of course I'm gonna mess with you. Can't do that. There's so much wrist, wrist, rich history here, Galactic Grunt. Like I, I know you guys have plans to do it, like and destroy the whole Sinnoh region and create your own little special world. But no, no, I already planned on stopping that. I'll plan. I'll, I'll stop this too. Your level 25 Beautifly. Never stood a shot. So next, Krogunk. If you're a little stronger and faster, that you could actually do something to me, but. Done. Yo, Magnezone's so strong. Our team. Our team is too good. I just got worked over, and by a kid, no less. Hey, money. That's what we need. Too much to handle. Whatever. I'm out of this one-horse town. There's nothing to do here anyways. Did you explore the ruins? Well, aren't you quite the trainer? That was magnificent. As the elder of Celestic Town, I give you my thanks. Oh, that old charm. May I see that, dear? What's that? You said Cynthia entrusted you with it to deliver to me? That's Cynthia. She's my granddaughter. You handed over the old charm to the elder. This old charm is something made in Celestic Town long, long ago. Could you imagine? If you get an old charm in Legends. It was made in honor of a mythical deity said to have created Sinnoh. These old charms are still discovered now and again. Since you're in Celestic Town, why not look around inside the ruins? Okay, sure. The Dialog and Palkia are on the outside. And Azelf, Mispirit, Uxie, 
are all in here. You examine the ancient cave painting. Mysterious designs cover a whole section of the wall. There are the three strange things forming a triangle. In the middle of them is a shining sphere. What is all of this about? I, I, I wonder. I wonder how much of an effect the story that these three are going to have in Legends. Uh, I know it's rumored that uh, Giratina is actually going to have a big part of it. And that's why he wasn't given as much of a big thing here. So I wonder how much we'll see of these three. The cave painting reminds me of an old story. There existed a being, a being so powerful, it was considered a deity at the time. Opposing this being were three Pokemon. The three kept balance with the with the one, as if it formed, they formed a triangle. Huh? Are they talking about Giratina here? Because they said it like protects from that one, and I don't, I don't think it's Arceus. It could be Arceus, but I don't think it is. Okay. You can use surf from your Poketch to cross water, such as seas and rivers. To use that hard home, hard home gym, have it yourself. Got it, old lady. What? I'm a little confused. In the middle of them is a shining sphere. What is all of this about? I mean, that looks more like Palkia's sphere than anything. So it could be referring to Palkia, and it'd just be a BDSP thing? Huh. There appears to have been an insignificant struggle here. Everyone should step back and view things from a bigger perspective. Yes, a bigger perspective, one that is on a universal scale. My name is Cyrus. I seek the power to create a new world, a world without strife. However, that power seems to be unavailable here. We've met before. Yes, it was at Mount Coronet. If you discover any power de derived from the Legends of Sinnoh, inform me. For, for that power is what I need to create my new world. Okay. Doesn't battle you. He just goes, yeah. Hey. Let me know. Let me know what is up. Like, he doesn't even give you the option to say no. Did I heal? Do I need to heal? I don't need to heal. Okay. Uh, he doesn't even, like, give you an option to say no. no that I'll take it. <laughs> I'll take it. Um, I guess we can go straight to Heart Home now. I mean, there is this route. There is trainer... Trainers on this route. Grepa Berry. Interesting. What are you? I Ayapa -pa 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 Berries. Got it. <laughs> Replant my Ayapapa berry. What are you? Asper berries. I think I already have multiple of you. I could plant that super effective one if I wanted to. I have four. What one? The Pasho? Sure, I'll, I'll plant the Pasho. I feel like if we do want to get into a competitive in this game, Pasho berries could be something worth um, doing. And what did I just get? A Petra? I, I probably could have planted in that one. Um, is there anything worth it here? I feel like that trainer that's standing on the edge gives you a TM. But there's people in our way. Is this going to be a Golbat and a uh, Skaroopy? There's a Skaroopy. Um, I mean, I could just go to the gym fight. And actually be close to the levels. Or I could just fight all these guys. Uh, they won't give me too much. So I could just fight these guys. Golbat. I, see, I knew it. I knew it. Um, it won't be, it's not end of the world type of deal by doing that. Golbat will give a bit. Uh, Bronzor that we're about to fight will probably give a little bit. Infernape level 38. I, I physically cannot, like I'm not allowed to use him. 
Unless, like, it's a main fight or something. Okay. Okay. Swap. Mammoth Swine. Give Mammoth Swine some action. Strength Boulder. This guy will fight me with his little... With his little Bronzor. Maybe Chimeco type of deal. No, it's a Bronzor. And you could, you could be Heatproof. You could be Levitate. Regardless of that, I'm just going... Oh, it's not very effective. Let's see. Are you Levitate? No. Nope. Gone. Done. Out of here. Bronzor. Nice. Nice. We'll take it. Uh, you give me a TM. Yep, I, my brain, it sometimes remembers some things. Sometimes it doesn't remember others. Okay, uh, we'll fight this person, this bird keeper. With its Staravia, maybe. Maybe a Knocked Owl. But most likely Staravia. Knocked Owl. Okay, most likely Knocked Owl. Got it. Got it. Ice Fang. Goodbye. Done. Fight over. Yo, it's level 31. Like, maybe... They gave a couple people some levels in case you do wait to fight these until you're going to Mount Coronet, which would be cool. Uh, 31 really doesn't do much to us, but hey. Hey, I'll, I'll take a little bit of a toughness. Because we're about to go into the gym and just have an easy time. Actually, thinking about it, I don't know how easy it's going to be. Crow gunk. Um, because... We will gain some experience, so we will be overleveled. Uh, these three will probably be 38. Um, and these... You'll probably be 39, 38, 39. And these two will definitely be 39. So we, we will have the experience over them. But still, it's going to be closer, and without Drapion, we don't have a Pokemon that really does the fight 100%. Unless we teach Roselia Shadow Ball and just Shadow Ball everything. Which, which would be fair. I, I... Thinking about it. But, nah, we'll be fine. And the good news is, is, hey... We're, we're so much closer to getting a Roserade now. Okay, that should be it. Bop. Ooh. Oh, the freeze. Let's go. Let's go. Ice Shard. And work put in the choke. Gone. I... And I'd ask you guys, I know it would give us a bunch of experience. Keep old moves. Do I, or do I not, take on these routes? Uh, I'm asking this out loud for no reason because you guys cannot tell me. Because I'm so far ahead, like in recording, bulk recording, that whatever you guys say is already going to be decided. Because this is a whole route we do need to explore. But that will put us more overleveled. So maybe I'll debate it in between the two episodes. Because I'm not going to record it straight up right now. It <laughs> The little bulk recording session is done for the moment. But I'm going to wrap up this episode here. Thank you guys for watching. Um... We're, we're, we're in such a good position. We got Night Slash now. Uh, thank you guys for watching. In the next episode, we're either going to be doing Pastoria City or 
will will either be going not Pastoria. Well, we'll either be in Pastoria City to do the route, and we could always use our boy Crobat and Luxio tag teaming it. They're a little under leveled, but hey, 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 maybe, maybe, or we'll be still in Heart Home City, ready to take on the gym. But thank you guys for watching. Until next time, everyone. Peace.